Hi guys, this is Athia Shetty and today I'm going to be talking to you about my skincare and makeup routine using my favorite products from Sephora. So usually I prefer to have a more minimalistic and effortless uh, routine when it comes to makeup and skincare. Um, something that makes my skin feel healthy and um, hydrated. Um, and I feel like Sephora is the best place for me to order all my products because it has a bunch of different ranges um, for all skin types, all skin tones. And um, yeah, some of them are Sunday Riley, Lancome and many, many more. So let's go on the skincare and makeup journey with me. And hopefully this helps um, you and you have fun. The first step of my skincare routine is the Ultra Glow Toner by Sephora. Um, I love this product because it's vegan, um, it's unscented so it doesn't cause any irritation to my skin. I have extremely sensitive skin. Um, what I love about it as well is that it's vitamin C and E enriched um, which helps me keep my skin hydrated and it doesn't have that sticky and disgusting feeling that some donors have. Um, this feels really, really easy on the skin. It's extremely lightweight. Okay, step two. A lot of you have seen me using this product because I swear by it. It's the Lancome Genifique Serum. Um, I love it because again, it's extremely lightweight. Um, the texture is really, really, nice on the skin it doesn't feel heavy and sticky and i rub it feel really nice and firm yeah i feel like my skin is really dry and flaky and it gets really bad during the winters so this product just makes it firm the elasticity of my skin feels strong this is all i use and it just makes it feel hydrated and plump. Okay, step number three is my Sunday Riley vitamin C oil. This is a really nice oil because it's brightening. It helps with dark, dark spots and pigmentation and vitamin C should be used during the day. I think that's something that's really important. So I will just take a little bit and I kind of just Rub and massage it. Not sticky, even though it's an oil, it feels really, really light. It absorbs really quickly. Um, and I think vitamin C is really important. Um, and also what I love about this product, let me get a tissue, is that it has turmeric. And um, I think turmeric is something that is used in India very widely. Um, it's also great for Indian skin tones and um, our skin type. My last skincare step is my Caudalie sunscreen SPF 50. It doesn't have a white cast. I hate the white cast and how it sticks to your face. And this is how you're actually supposed to put sunscreen. So let me show you. You're supposed to put it on three fingers and that's the right amount. You rub it nicely and you apply it. I also apply it to my lips because I feel if you don't have a great and handy SPF lip balm, then you can apply it to your lips. So I am done with my skincare routine and we're on to makeup. Let me give you a slight disclaimer. I manage when I'm not with my makeup artist, although I'm extremely dependent on her. So this will kind of be a test of how I do my makeup. So my first step always is primer. Um, this is the Smashbox Hydrating Primer. You get two types of primer, which I have been told. One is mattifying and one is hydrating. And if you have dry skin like me, then you should use the hydrating. Put some on the palm of my hand and I put it on my 
it helps the makeup last longer but it also gives a nicer finish i really like this primer um because it's not thick at all it kind of feels like you're putting a serum on your face it has hyaluronic acid which is extremely important in your skincare routine my go-to primer is smashbox and now we're on to step number two which is my go-to concealer and i use this as foundation as well because i'm not a big foundation fan but i also feel like it helps um give you a more natural and a very nice finish when you use your fingers so i like to use some i literally just dab it on i think i'm done with my concealer and spot concealing like i mentioned using your hands gives it a more natural finish um so that's what i like Okay, so my third step is um, Benefit Cosmetics, precisely my brow pencil. I love to brush my brows upwards. So I don't really do my eyebrows. Um, I like to keep them natural. Um, but as you can see, I do have um, some areas on my brow that is not as bushy as the rest. So to even it out, I use a brow pencil and what I do is that I like to slightly create like very very fine lines that is what I do and I feel like this brow pencil is perfect for it so you can automatically feel like it's much fuller um, so that is my step number three my step number four is the Natasha Denona palette of eyeshadows I absolutely love this palette because it kind of reminds me of a candy store it's so yummy all the colors they have beautiful pastels i'm really tempted to use pinks um because it just adds a little pop on your eyes and i also love the nudes i feel like it's perfect for my skin tone and for a lot of skin tones out there this is the only time i use a brush let's use bell which is a nudie pink um and then maybe we can have fun and use a little flutter or flare in the inner corners of the eye so apply it gently all around can you see it just adds a little glow automatically looks really pretty and effortless and like like a soft glam um okay so let's add a bit of the flutter slight flutter and we can add it in the inner corners here look i feel like it just adds and makes it like a complete look and makes your eyes kind of look like doe-eyed and big okay so that is my fourth step now i'm going to take you through my fifth step the sephora black ink classic line felt liner okay so now i'm gonna get really up close to the camera because i need to focus and concentrate it's not my strongest suit okay i completed this side too not bad it has a flexible tip um so for somebody like me it's really easy to kind of um create a shape and design on your eye next step one of my favorites is mascara but before i go to the mascara um something that i love doing is curling my lashes just to give it a fuller effect and look lashes also notice that this liner dries really quickly so there's no room for smudging and you don't have to worry about that at all it's the Too Faced mascara called better than sex completely transforming as you can tell that see it makes your lashes like suddenly just pop because of the color it's really dark and i feel like the way the wand is it's an hourglass wand so it, it's easier for application and my most favorite step of my makeup routine is my blush. This is the Nude Sticks um, blush. Even though it is extremely efficient and handy and it comes with 
a brush applicator that sharp by using it on my hands first. As you can see, it's extremely like well pigmented. I like to use my hands to kind of just blend it in and then apply it to my cheeks. I feel like we can put a little more. And the more the blush, the better. And I also have this trick where I kind of apply a little bit of blush on my nose, at the tip of my nose. So it kind of feels like a sun-kissed look. Okay, so my last step um, of my makeup routine is my lip blush by Sephora itself. It glides on really smoothly. It's super pigmented. It actually feels like butter when you put on. It's really, really lightweight. A must have. And I top it off by the Sephora Glossed. What I hate about lip glosses is that it kind of, your hair sticks to it. It feels like super sticky and very, very like glue. This has none of that. It glides on really well. As you can see, it feels like a balm rather than a lip gloss. So it's not sticky at all. My Way by Giorgio Armani. Mm. I love this smell because it smells fresh. So we are finally done with my makeup routine and my skincare routine. I chose a soft glam look because I prefer um, doing and achieving this look by myself. It's easy in terms of application. I'm very familiar with the products and it doesn't feel too hectic on my face, um, but at the same time, it gives me that sun-kissed um, look, which I love. But you can get all these products on the Sephora app, a Sephora store near to you, or on the website, sephora.now.com. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys go and check out all the products, have fun and have as much fun as I did creating this video for you. Um, so enjoy and lots of love.